Every rose has its thorn. By What's Poison up? On Amazon Music. I missed you guys, my fucking dreamers. And the cowboy is saying, fuck yeah, motherfuckers. <sighs> this is the XRP Cowboy. Hi, this is Billy. We got a little bit of a ramble about the fucking man. We both lie silent and still in the dead of the night. Although we both lie close together, we feel miles apart inside. Was it something I said or something I did? Did my words not come out right? Though I tried not to hurt you, though I tried, but I guess that's why they say every rose has its thorn. Just like every night has its dawn. Just like every cowboy sings a sad, sad song. Every rose has its dawn. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. My dreamer. I couldn't do this without you. I listen. I listen to my favorite song playing on the radio. Hear the DJ say loves a claim of easy coming, easy go. But I wonder, does he know? Has he ever felt like this? And I know that you'd be here right now if I could let you know Every rose has its thorn Every night has its dawn Just like every cowboy sings a sad, sad song Every rose has its thorn yeah, it does. I can still feel so much pain. Like the night that cuts you and wounds you to the scar that scarred it on me. Just like every night has its dawn. Just like every cowboy sings a sad, sad song Every rose has its song Alexa off Hey, this is the XRP fucking cowboy and this is Billy I just felt a little Brett Michaels tonight There was a little war um, but I, I hope we, fi we fixed it and worked it out tonight because I just caught my fucking sleeve on fire. Oh my God, I thought I was going to be on fire and I didn't want to tell you guys, but I put the fire out. Um, <laughs> but Paul, I, I believe you're true with what you're saying. And I, I, I would say in some groups you may not have crossed the line, but like my comment to Amy. Thank you, Amy, so much. I had to, uh, I, I was defensive, you know, and if I, you know, if I was, it was a stupid fucking comment, fucker, but I was defensive and sensitive, so I want to make a public apology to you, not for what I fucking said, but how much, I don't know, pain that that created, and that, you know? And if you were just joking, and maybe I didn't think it was a good joke, and I overreacted, I'm sorry, but I have to appreciate you and uh, and all my other um, subscribers because you're obviously watching and seeing what's going on, so I appreciate that. And you may have some knowledge. I wish you'd make a channel, you know, because, you know, I don't want harm for anyone. I want to support channels. I always hype up the channels. That's why I'm always talking about jungle. 
That guy's fucking great. Can't wait to have a fucking beer with him. But anyways, we're going to talk about fucking Elon fucking Musk. You know, he keeps pulling his little dick out and fucking trying to get everybody to suck it. And his dick's getting sucked all the fucking time. And I warned the Elon Musk bets, Wall Street bets, community that this was going to happen. I said he committed security fraud. He pumped and dumped his own stock and he shorted it. And I said he was going to sell all of his, Tesla was going to sell all their fucking Bitcoin. And I said, watch, that's the next thing that's going to come up. Even though they said 10%. 10 fucking percent. Yeah, right. This gets so serious if my phone dies because I'm out of fucking memory. And then, you know, multiple people said to me, if he, he, if he, if he sold it or was going to sell it, I said he probably already sold it. We'd know about it. Well, we just found out he's planning on selling all of his fucking tes- his Bitcoin stock. So, do you think I just, I have fucking psychic fucking ability? Billy is going to say, hey, calm down, cowboy. You're acting like an idiot. You know, and I'll say this. You know, I don't, I, you know, the cowboy doesn't have psychic ability. Either do I. But, <laughs> I don't need him to fucking talk for me, Okay. I wouldn't even let that motherfucker wash my car. Just joking, Paul. I wouldn't let him. But Billy's going to say, oh, my God, it was so obvious he was going to do that. I mean, come on, guys. You know, I said this would happen. I said, you know, I've been fucking shitting on Elon from the beginning because he's the fucking knight. He's the people that are invested in us. They're invested in us. You know, I'm a libertarian. I don't support these fucking banks. You know, Cowboy's starting to creep in. I do, but I don't. But I know they're investing in us because if if it wasn't for us investors, there'd be no liquidity and these banks couldn't come in and use it. And they didn't want to, but they didn't want the crypto space to go around them. So hesitantly, they decided to invest in the coin that had their back to fuck over all the libertarians. So, but they're invested in us. So I feel better, but so to think that fucking Batman, so to think that fucking Batman is like, um, not going to sell all of his fucking Bitcoin. You got to go back a little bit. You have to go back at, to the beginning when he, when he bought it. That was the exact same time he was saying it was a little better than the U.S. fiat, like, and he bashed it, and it got cheaper, and he bought it while it got cheaper. Is that somebody that is fraudulent? I mean, I guess it just depends on if you look at the definition or you look at how you want to suck on his fucking little dick, okay? Dick, fucking dick. You fucking dick, you dick sucking little fucking dick. I'm I'm saying he's dick sucking a little fucking dick, Elon's. And I'm also saying he's a little fucking dick at the same time. I'm fucking like a genius. Come with me. I will show you to the light. And the crypto market, if you're freaking out by it right now, you're fucking crazy. This is how good things happen when bad things are going away. And it is about to fucking rocket every fucking thing, okay? But when the SEC lawsuit gives ripple clarity, the shit may hit the fan for altcoins. But right now, this is going to rocket the market. When Just remember, every dollar that transfers out of Bitcoin, when it dumps, 75 cents goes into the altcoin market. It's just delayed because people have to sell and they have to buy and they're waiting to buy because they think it could go down more and it, it, it just takes a couple of days to accumulate. Maybe a week. But so <clears throat> back to fucking Elon. You know, 
we're, he's invested in us. But it's funny, XRP's at 50 cents right now. It's a little more, but it could bl it drop down. But even if it was at $1.20 with where Bitcoin is right now, that should have pulled it down 40% at a minimum. Like it pulled down a lot of things. Even 20%, but it hasn't. Why do you think that is? Was Elon Musk activated? <laughs> he obviously was when he brought Bitcoin into it, but all the fucking YouTubers got him fucking wrong. And the cowboy's going to say, yeah, they're fucking wrong. They're not using their fucking brain, okay? They're not using this. Detroit, motherfucker. Elon Musk is invested in Ripple. Not directly. Just like he wasn't directly invested in his shorts. Just like how he never talks about it, but he implies it. Like he said, I need something energy efficient that's quicker. And I'm not saying he's going to use it right away. But it's weird. He hates the SEC, so maybe he will just to piss him off. But um, the thing is, is he bought this he bought Bitcoin to destroy it. I will buy Bitcoin again with some contracts if it goes to 38,000. I might sneak in below 40, but and it might even drop lower. But I think if I do a six month contract, it'll pay off really well. But so there's this uh, what's the band? It doesn't matter. All in. All hands on deck, mates. This ship was built to sink. And they last through the night. And it felt so right. I think so, you know, thanks a lot. But I, I don't know if the words were right. But the point is, is he bought that ship to sink it. And he was the chosen one. So, with like just like the much wow. You know, time to buy XRP. And you know what? Um, he bought this ship to sink it. He didn't buy it and then figure out that it wasn't energy. I made a video saying Elon Musk would never buy fucking X. Uh, not. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, everybody. Just a bunch of dislikes. Please like and subscribe. I'd like some more, more followers. It would help me reach more people if you like what I'm saying or you'll never see this face again. And that's probably a blessing. But but his partner was invested in Ripple. And which and you know that indirectly makes him invested with PayPal and he's in the payment systems. He described a payment system that was loosely, if you reach a little, exactly like XRP or creating something like that. So you don't, and you don't think he still thinks about his payments? You don't still think about a fucking ex-boyfriend or a girlfriend, motherfucker? You're fucking lying to yourself. Maybe they had nicer tits, or they were just more loving, or they kissed you more on the face. Or they had a huge fucking cock, and you didn't like them. You don't want to be with them, but you think about that fucking cock, right? So, you don't think he thinks about PayPal that put him on the map? So, I think he built it, not because he bought it, uh, Bitcoin, not because he didn't understand it. You don't put a billion five. That's 15,000 million into something if you don't know what it does. I mean, it's not like he's a fucking rocket scientist. Because he, implore, he employs and he, he implores rocket scientists to do better because he he's smarter than they are. So he's above a fucking rocket scientist. And you don't and it doesn't take a rocket scientist to realize that Bitcoin isn't energy efficient. In fact, I don't think he could have bought it for Tesla if they didn't do a, a great deal of research, cost an analysis and um psych psychographics. So he knew all this shit before, okay? And he bought it fucking anyways. Why would he do that? 
and risk his reputation because he is that fucking powerful. He knows people will look past it. You know? Just like JFK fucking Marilyn Monroe, right? Um, Cowboy will say he was thinking with his right head, but Billy's going to say, no, he fucking wasn't. Fucking A. He had a beautiful wife and family. I get so fucking mad at the cowboy. And, you know, it's it's funny. You know, everybody thinks this is a show, you know, with the split personalities, but it's not. It's just who I am. And, it, and you all know it's who you fucking are, too. And if you say, no, I'm not, I want you to think about this. There's something you've wanted to say to somebody that you would never say because it's rude. And then you drank too much. And you fucking said it. They didn't like it. But you felt good that you said it. Because that motherfucker needed to hear that fucking shit. Before you put a fucking... Knock their fucking teeth out, you know? Or fucking perfectly placed a Chinese star. Right in between their teeth. Seriously, though. And then woke up the next morning regretting what you said. You know? Or maybe you got a call back from that person and said, I'm so glad you said that to me. You know, I didn't like it, but... And you're like, I'm sorry for saying it, but you knew you helped somebody. It's because you were the fucking XRP cowboy. You were the purest version of yourself. And you didn't think about how you would be perceived. You thought about you what you thought about was how how you could fucking be honest and tell the truth. And you know what? Fuck them if they can't handle it. But if one out of ten grows from it, it's fucking worth it. But Billy's just thinking, I want everybody to be happy and grow, and then nobody does. And then fucking nobody does. I'm just bringing myself to life in front of a fucking camera, you know? I'm the super dad, soccer dad, but I'm also the fucking drunk guy that smokes too much, thinks about driving his fucking Harley into a wall at 180 miles an hour and saying, fuck this place, I'll see you later, okay? That's who we are. But we do have the same fucking dream and that dream is coming true every day we should be happy we should be so bullish on XRP because of where it is with Bitcoin crashing to fucking shit land because the plan for Elon Musk was to bring awareness to this crypto and pump the fucking shit out of it and his payday was cashing out and I'll tell you what, I said when he cashed out 10, he probably cashed out, and he did. This guy knew it wasn't energy efficient, and he knew it wasn't, by holding it, it, it wasn't energy efficient either, which is why he's saying he's going to sell the rest of it now. But you're going to see that he had already sold it before his little tweets went public. So he wouldn't sell 10 fucking percent and then drop the price and then sell the rest. That would be fucking stupid, even though it's probably higher than what he paid for. it. And he, he was activated to fucking destroy Bitcoin because there's no way somebody that's get all about being green and energy efficient would have invested in it. And, and now he's, and he's acting like he just figured it out. You don't put fifteen thousand. You don't put one thousand five hundred million dollars into an investment. A country could fucking, he could cure fucking hunger with that amount of money. He could give every child in the world money and food for that kind of money. For weeks and weeks. 
you don't invest in something like that if you're not trying to fucking destroy it or the company you own. And he wasn't trying to, to destroy the company he fucking owns. So, my fucking dreamers. That's what we're fucking talking about. He's invested in XRP. And for him to get activated, that tells me that we were really close. Because there's levels of non-disclosures. One is you can't fucking say shit. And if people say something to you about it, act like they're wrong. Imply that they're way off base. Then there's a level of just act like you, you don't know yet. Two big different things. Like, is John a nice guy? Mm, I don't know. That's level one. Is John a nice guy? I don't know. But now, he's at the level of, he was at those levels. Is John a nice guy? <laughs> I don't know. You know? Or he's at the... Yeah, that's... You know? It's like... Is John gonna... Is John dating your sister? I don't know. It's like that. You know? So... You know, I guess... You know, I'm buying fucking cyber trucks because you can't drive a Lambo on the moon. And I'm sitting on the rocket ship. It looks like my fucking garage. Or my fucking spaceship but you know what as Elon would say we're all simulation it looks like my garage to you but it's really the XRP fucking doge rocket going to the fucking moon because my my enemy is actually my friend because he's going to help us get to where we need to be Unfortunately, Elon Musk may end up being the captain to our ship. But you know what? That little dick bitch wants to give me some fucking money. I'm going to take it for him. I'm not gay, but fucking 20 bucks is 20 bucks, motherfuckers. Cross the town, the young girl plays guitar. In a government yard. What is the words? To the, the most beautiful words. It was a Saturday. I came home early. Drunk with love and other things. Yeah, and I love my XRP community. And you're beautiful. I'm sorry I'm rambling. I just missed you guys. And if these were dentures, I wouldn't be missing that tooth, would I? Love. But we're all friends now.